Happy Saturday! It's time to go support the animals. I am so excited to be back at the All Friends Animal Sanctuary. I definitely mentioned this place back in, oh, there's my sister. We were actually here back in October doing this exact same thing where they have this rummage sale and they have local vegan food vendors as well. There's my sister! <laughs> So we're going to shop the rummage sale, maybe get some lunch, and definitely pet some animals. Last time I was here, they definitely had cows and pigs and chickens and turkeys and stuff. All right, let's go. I went to it first I, I Friday last weekend when they were there. Oh, here's a guy right here. Hi, buddy. Oh my gosh, he's so big. He's so big. He has a whole little bed on the tree. I know. What a perfectly shaped bed. Oh, he's cute. Did you build that yourself? Did you dig yourself a hole? Mm -hmm. Oh my god. He's cute. <laughs> yeah. I got my wagon in my car. <laughs> Might need to go get the wagon. Oh my gosh, I wonder if everything is a dollar again. Do you want to look at all that? Yeah, I guess let's look at the animals. Oh my gosh, he's got a big tennis ball too. Is there anybody in there? I see cows. Oh wow, look at that turkey wandering. Oh my gosh! Oh, hello! That's a pretty cow right there, huh? Two of them. Oh, goats fighting. Where's goats? They're way over there. You want to be able to get them with me. Oh! Look at this turkey! Hello, sir! Oh my gosh! <laughs> I know. He likes to pull, but he won't. Aww. <laughs> oh. Okay. Are you? He, he won't. Charlie. He okay. Won't. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh. Oh, we got ducks. Oh, he's making me nervous. I'm vegan, I promise. <laughs> oh, look at the cow right up by the. Oh, oh, hi, buddy. Are you nice? Are you nice? Oh my gosh. <laughs> How many birthdays ago was it, was it when I said I just wanted to pet a cow? He's coming at the chicken. You might want to get this footage. <laughs> so many animals in one farm friends. Dude, this guy, he's just a little intimidating. <laughs> oh, I just got a whiff of the cow. Oh, I want to touch him. I want to touch a baby cow. Right. Dude, this guy is our new friend, I guess. Your tour guide. <laughs> Turkey tours. Wow, look at his giant feet. Do you want petted? <laughs> oh my gosh, you're so cute. Oh, oh. Did you see his tongue? Hi, buddy. It was huge. Oh, grass puppy. Don't step on turkey. Oh my gosh, I know. I don't want to piss him off. Oh, there's a rooster. He's handsome. Goats, yay, my faves. Oh, hello, 
guys. Oh. Oh my gosh, look at that guy sitting in the, like he's taking a bath. Oh, and that guy's like in the grass feed tub. Oh, there's a bunch more ducks too. Ooh, pregnant or aggressive, I don't know. Oh, hello. Why, why is he alone? Oh, are you a rammer? Is that why you're alone? He, he wants to be lovable, but, but then sometimes he gets... I have a cat just like that. I swear he <laughs> wants to love me, but he gets so angry. Hello. Oh, you're so cute. Oh. other turkey, Bucky's girlfriend. <laughs> Wait, the turkey's name is Becky? No, Bucky is. Oh! Then, then they went and then this is his girlfriend. Aww. Aww. <laughs> Aww. Oh. Looks like maybe another turkey in there. Oh yeah, look at the pretty white turkey. Hello. Hello. I see an egg in there. Oh. Oh, is he being nice? <laughs> that is so cute. We're gonna get a little slobbery. You're gonna get slobbery, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <gasps> yes. Oh, what's her name? I got one for you too, girly. Here you go. Oh, 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 I dropped it. I'm sorry. Here we go. Try again. Okay. Tuck the thumb in. Ah, ah! I'm sorry, I'm too nervous. Yeah, you put it in your hand. <laughs> there we go. Oh, what a sweetheart. And this is Bucky. He's been following us around a while. He's our tour guide. He loves him and he also is protected at his girl. Yeah. Do you love your house? Do you love your house? Cute. Yeah, the big one uh, in the front there is uh, Mr. Pigglesworth. Oh. Yeah, and when he was born, he had uh, he was born on a uh, pig farm, and he had pneumonia, so uh, he came out here. And he was in the air of this. Yeah. He's like years old. Um, <laughs> Aww. And, uh, hey, girls. They'll be sheared soon. I know. I thought she was oh, like, no, oh, 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 wow. Says, Welcome to my house. <laughs> That's, I've never seen such a, th the other one's letting loose too. <laughs> Happy to see you. <laughs> I I'm, so. That is like the least <laughs> gross poop I've ever seen. It's not. It's like, it's like, it's like rabbit. Turf. That's what I was just going to say. It's Isn't like it rabbit. It's such a big animal. It makes those right. Little, right? Mm -hmm. I did. And I wondered too what we were stepping on. <laughs> That's oh! A, that's a wild one. Hi, oh, I guess he lives under the house. <laughs> Bucky, you just love us, don't you? He does. So, they're named after Storm Rogue and Phoenix. Uh, are those Marvel characters? Oh. <laughs> the dad was uh, Javier. <clears throat> he's like... Look at that little guy. Yeah, he's... Uh... Looking for some leftovers. So I've never cool. seen a dusty chipmunk. <laughs> oh, there he goes.
Here's a brand new one of those big giant jugs. Tempting. What's that? Oh. I don't think so. I forget what the name is, but I don't think that's it. Oh, it's a mirror. <laughs> oh, and look at this cute chair she got. And this thing is adorable. And look at my new lamp. I spent $25. And I'm thinking we're coming back tomorrow. Or today after yoga. All right, I got to get this lamp in. If I didn't have to leave to go teach my yoga class, I would have shopped for so much longer. And of course I had to tell everybody in my yoga class about the deals I got at the sale and tell them they should go check it out. So first thing I got is this big lamp. You can see it's taller than me. I'm five foot two and it's a little bit wobbly. I think some of the things just need a little bit tightened and definitely dusty, but it's got these nice shelves. My brother in Michigan has a lamp like this and I have admired it for years. I can't wait to tell him that I got the lamp for a dollar. And I think I already mentioned that, that everything was a dollar unless it was marked. And there was hardly anything marked more than a dollar. It was literally, I spent $25. I got 25 things. And maybe some of these things I didn't necessarily need, but Rather than struggle with making decisions, I decided to just spend the dollar since all the proceeds went to the animal sanctuary. Like, so is there really any bad purchases? Now these I needed and you cannot convince me otherwise. These are pineapple bookends. These totally go with a bunch of the other pineapple themed stuff that I have in my one bathroom. I love these. I think these are so cute. I got this little Vera Bradley wallet tag still on it. Brand new, was super excited to get that for a dollar. And then I picked up this little purple bag that I just thought was totally my style. I didn't see like a brand name or anything, but I just thought it was very cute. Matches my outfit today. My cats are just smelling everything. Like, do you guys smell cows? Do you smell cows, Ted? This cute little tie-dye puma bag was only a dollar. I think this will make such a good camera carrying bag. If I'm on a hike, this was a brand new unopened thing for a dollar. I really liked that little cleaning brush. I kind of bought it more for the cleaning brush than the cleaning solution. And then I got this purple wire basket. I don't know what it's gonna be for, but I just really liked it and it was only a dollar. That will come in handy somewhere for sure. So that was like eight things for a dollar and everything else was clothes. I did not realize I spent that much money on clothes, but I am justifying it by the fact that a lot of my clothes don't fit me anymore. I did need a few new things. So this first item was not a necessity, but it was a necessity if you know what I mean. It is my absolute favorite colors of tie dye and it's stitch and it's a scarf. And look how good it goes with my outfit today. Obviously was not turning that down for a dollar. Brand new leggings for a dollar. Not so sure about the color. I don't know if that'll be a part of my everyday wardrobe. I feel like these would be perfect at a Detroit Tigers game. These little pink shorts, they are Express brand. These are so cute. These just scream Elisha. Not a necessity, didn't do this on purpose, but how good would this look with the pink shorts? <sighs> oh my gosh. And then this dress, tag still on it. Like how cute is this going to be? Look at this little tassel belt detail. That just completely sold it for me. Oh, so cute. Little Hawaiian dress, made in Hawaii. Can never have too many of these for the summer. What did I just say about Hawaii dresses? Can never have too many, especially when they are in shades of blue. Oh, and this one, there was actually 
two of these. So my sister got one and we're gonna show up in matching dresses somewhere. <laughs> And the back of it is so cute. I almost want to wear this today. I got this top, which I feel like was probably a part of a Hawaiian set, but I will style it on its own, I suppose. Actually, it kind of goes with this sarong I got. How cute is this? This gives me Lion King vibes. This cute little yoga top. Eat beans, not beans. This sweatshirt was definitely a little bit faded, but I thought it still looked really good, and it just screams Elisha. I'm not sure where I'm going to wear this, but it is black velvet, and the buttons are these little hearts, and it's short. So I, I just thought it was adorable. I can't wait to wear that somewhere. I just do not know where. Probably Fremont Street. <laughs> I got these little Nike shorts. How cute are those? Love that green color, duh. I got these leggings. I think they are Capri length and they are Fabletics brand and I thought they looked brand new. I thought those were super cute. And more leggings Capri length. I thought these also looked brand new and I liked the pattern on them. And I'm hoping these look better once I wash them. I don't think they look that bad. They're a size small, but it must be a men's small because they definitely look a little bit big. But I have wanted Adidas tearaway pants basically since high school. Why I have never bought myself a pair, I don't know. I did today for a dollar. <laughs> and then I got this bikini. I think it is Shein, but I don't see it on the tag, but it looks like a Shein tag. But it was brand new. The bottoms are definitely smaller than what I would probably wear in public, but for tanning at my sister's pool, this will be super cute. Two more things. This cat t-shirt that was like a Harry Potter lightning bolt and a cat. It was just so cute, I had to get it. Oh my gosh, and then this one was just ridiculous. <laughs> How cute is that? So that is my haul for today, but my sister and I already have plans to go back tomorrow. My problem is that my work is only like eight minutes away, so when I get out of work tomorrow, I have no reason to not stop by. It's literally on the drive home, like, and I have to support the animals. Hey, Ted. Come here, Teddy. Ted. Oh, Ted, you grumpy. Say, be well. Penny? Penny, what's your voice?